as we talk about the bigotry towards heterosexual couples. I'm sure you guys have been following the scandal. I haven't actually spoken out on it because it's just so ridiculous. Candace Cameron Bure, uh, she works over now at a network called Great American Family. And she was giving an interview in the Wall Street Journal and she talked about how happy she was that she worked for a network that would be putting traditional marriages on display. Great. Amazing. It's it's so unique nowadays to see traditional marriage and values on display, to see Christian values on display at all, that she should be proud to work with a network that is okay with that, right? Now every network is going the other direction. They're like, you got to have something lesbian, gay, trans, whatever. But she's proud to work there. And this caused an absolute firestorm that people are saying, I can't believe she said this. Chief among them, by the way, is a girl probably saying her last name wrong, Jojo Siwa. She used to be on that dance competition show. I actually watched her on that dance competition show. She was super likable. She then went on to have a very lucrative YouTube career because she appeals to children and she's sparkly and and I, great. All these things are happy for her. But she's come out now as a lesbian a few years ago and she has a girlfriend. And so now she thinks that what we want to hear from her rather than her just making kids have fun is how much of a lesbian she is. And she has attacked Can- Candace Cameron Burr. This is the second time she's attacked her. The first time she attacked her it was because Candace Cameron Burr did, not- Burre did not see her at an event and she took it as a personal attack. Personally, I think Jojo Sewell has feelings for Candace Cameron Bure. She's got some fascination with her. Candace Cameron Bure apologized for not seeing her at an event and reached out to her and was very kind and accepting. But now Jojo Sewa is again mad at her, Candace Cameron Bure, because Candace Cameron Bure likes traditional marriages. Yeah, she likes traditional marriages. Like, you like untraditional marriages. You are constantly promoting your fact that you're a lesbian. Why can't Cameron Candace Bure promote the fact that she is a Christian conservative. Oh, I know why, Jojo, because you're a bigot. You think you're accepting, but you're actually a bigot, right? You guys have got every letter under the sun, L-G-B-T-Q-R-S-T-U-V. Well, how about an H in there for heterosexual? How about a C in there for Christian and conservative? Can you guys fit a little more room in your alphabet soup to be accepting toward people who do not live that way? who do not have homosexual marriages. It, nobody yells at you for doing your YouTube channel and talking about your lesbian relationship with your girlfriend every five seconds. Maybe you could leave her alone for the work that she does and saying that I would also like to put the way that I live on display. It is miraculous to me that people like Jojo Sua cannot see their own hypocrisy, that they think that the only way that people have to live is exactly like them, which far from making them accepting, Jojo, it makes you a bigot. So leave Candace Cameron Bure alone. She's just not that into you. All right, guys, next portion of the show is going to be available exclusively on Daily Wire Plus. I'm going to be talking about a strange Twitter account called Pup Ravage, where members of the army are posting photos of themselves in pup play kink costumes. So if you're not a member yet, go ahead and click the link in the description and subscribe right now.